Hi, this is Jeremiah of Gracious Watch. Firstly, I'd like to thank my friend and business partner Yen of Miami Watch Company for giving me access to how to design, manufacture, and launch a watch company on Udemy. I was privileged to go through the course conducted by such an experienced watch business investor and owner. I started Gracious Watch about three years ago at the time of recording this video, and I thought I already knew a lot about the watch industry. I was blinded by the success of my existing website, Gracious Watch, and was totally complacent for quite a while. Before I go through the course, I thought to myself that all the information herein would be familiar to me, but I was completely blown away with the quality and information Yen Hen provided. Whether you are an experienced player in the industry or you are just starting out, you will definitely benefit from this course. I personally gained and learned so much from Section 3 of the course, Watch Manufacturers, I think this is the most important part of the course especially if you are planning to start your own watch company. Starting a watch company of your own can be a long, tedious and expensive process when you have no experience or connection whatsoever. Yan highlighted several of his past experiences which I believe can save watch companies and business owners a huge amount of time and money. Alright, so here's the course layout. First introduction followed by watch industry, watch manufacturers, watch components and specifications, watch accessories, financials, design process, manufacturing process, marketing strategy, summary and conclusion, resources, and lastly, bonus success stories. So now let's talk a little about the pros of this course. Pro number one, detailed and informative. It is a very good start to have a dream to own your own watch company someday, but a dream will only remain a dream if you have no idea what you are doing. In section 4, Yen discuss all the basic components and specifications in a watch. There are so many options to choose from. To give you a short example, here are some of the options you will have to consider. The movement. ETA Swift movement versus Japanese Miyota Citizen movement versus other kinds of movements. Case material. 316 Surgical Steel, 304 Titanium, Ceramic, Platinum 950 or other materials Crystal, Sapphire Crystal or Mineral Glass Crown, Push Pull or Screw Down And Manufacturer, which manufacturers to consider and which to avoid like a plague Yen took the extra mile to recommend what movement to use when you are first starting out What kind of crystal you should be, should be using to increase the longevity of your brand and timepieces this section alone is priceless and could possibly save you a lot of undue trial and error. Pro number 2. Tons of graphs, pictures and statistics. A very interesting lesson in watch history with pictures and graphs shows you which companies have the biggest market shares, which countries have the highest import rate, graphs on countries that buy classical timepieces versus smart watches, what kind of movement have the best sales compared to other kind of movements? Who are the top market leaders in the watch industry today? And many other helpful information that could help you to make better and easier decisions along the way. Pro number 3. To see if you are prepared enough to start your own watch company. Starting a watch company is fun and interesting especially in the designing process. If all you have right now is a sketch design the name of the company, then you are definitely missing out on the other 80%. Yen goes into the rest of the 80% without beating around the bush. Covers each section with absolute precision to make sure you are ready for what is coming up in this exciting venture. Pro number 4. This course is designed for your success. The creator of this course, Yen, is absolutely interested in your success. He does not just go through with you the history, specifications, designing, manufacturing, but most importantly, he covers the marketing section. So what if you have a great design and packaging but lacks the awareness and marketing strategies? Changes are you will be stacking up piles and piles of goods instead of selling them like hot cakes. Alright, so now let's talk about the cons of this course. Right, con number one, too much information to take in. I tried to go through this course in a day and I was overwhelmed. I could not focus so I decided to stop the course and grab a cup of coffee. I come back a day later and resume the course and I was able to take in the information better. It also helps if you have a paper and pen while going through the course. It will definitely help a lot, at least it did for me. If you are buying this course, I have two simple advice. 
Do not go through this course in a hurry. Be patient with yourself and the instructor. Number two, go through the videos over and over again if you have to to digest the information thoroughly. All right, conclusion. I'm giving my tarot and unbiased review here like my team and I always do. This course is an absolute must-have if you are planning to start your own watch company. I did a lot of interviews on Gracious Watch with founder, CEO, director of watch companies. But some companies I've seen could not even last a year. And I'm pretty sure some of these founders will pay a premium just to get a glimpse of the information laid out so nicely in this course. Alright, if you enjoyed this video, why not give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. This is Jeremiah of Gracious Watch, bringing love and passion to the race, signing out.